What is a stroke? It's the movement of the piston from top dead center to bottom dead center. Calling an engine four-stroke means its engine cycle has four strokes. A four-stroke gasoline engine uses internal combustion, so those four strokes must include the five key events common to all internal combustion engines. Intake, compression, ignition, power, and exhaust. Let's look at a simplified model. The intake stroke starts with the exhaust valve closed, the inlet valve opening, and the piston at its highest point, top dead center. It starts to move down, increasing the volume above the top of the piston. This makes pressure inside the cylinder lower than pressure outside. This higher outside air pressure forces air-fuel mixture into the cylinder. The piston reaches bottom dead center, the inlet valve closes, and the intake stroke ends. Both valves stay closed as the piston leaves bottom dead center. The piston moves up, squeezing the air-fuel mixture into a smaller and smaller volume, which compresses it. That makes its temperature rise, and that makes combustion easier. Just before the piston reaches top dead center, the next key event occurs. Ignition. Burning expanding gas generates the force to push down the piston. This is the power stroke that drives the engine. The piston now moves from bottom dead center to top dead center. The exhaust valve opens and the piston pushes out the leftover gases. Let's look at the cycle operating. Intake takes in air-fuel mixture. Compression squeezes the air-fuel mixture into a smaller and smaller volume. Ignition. The mixture under pressure is burned. Power. Burning expanding gases push the piston down creating a power stroke that turns the crankshaft. Exhaust. The piston moves upward, forcing burned gases from the chamber. All five events occur in this order in each of the engine cylinders.